Hi everyone, welcome to day one of Salad Week here on the Simply Quinoa channel. We are kicking off our week of salads with this seasonal autumn inspired salad that I know you guys are absolutely going to love. It has things like apples, pecans, and a creamy cashew cheese, which is my spin on an herbed goat cheese. It pairs really nicely with the maple tahini dressing that we made in yesterday's video, and it just has all of those lovely fall flavors that everybody loves this time of year. So if you are ready to dive into today's recipe with me, keep on watching and we'll get started. So we're actually gonna start by making our goat cheese. And the base of that is raw cashews that have been soaked overnight. And then we are also going to add in some lemon juice, some salt, and some dried herbs. The herbs we're using are dried oregano, dried parsley, some thyme, or you could also use rosemary, and also some garlic powder and onion powder. Then you're just gonna wanna add in a little bit of water to help everything get blended up. Pop it on your blender and blend until kind of smooth. It's gonna be thick. So then we are going to use a cheesecloth or nut milk bag and we're gonna put that into a bowl and then transfer all of that cheese mixture into the nut milk bag. And then you can just kind of squeeze it a little bit. And basically we're gonna wanna drain it. So how I did it was by using a chopstick and I just wrapped the top of the bag around the chopstick, secured it with a paper clip or binder clip, and then I just let it rest in this jar overnight to let some of the liquid drip out. So once we're ready to assemble the salad, we are going to start by chopping up the toppings and that includes slicing an apple. I like Macintosh apple, but you could use any variety that you like. And then we are also going to thinly slice about half of a red onion. A shallot would also be delicious here, but I happen to like the crunch and bite that red onions have. And then we go to our cheese. So you're just gonna unwrap the cheese and you will see that it has thickened up a little bit. Um, mine actually didn't drain off all that much water, but it is a nice creamy texture like goat cheese and you can see all the herbs in there and it's perfect. So we are going to first assemble all of the salad and put the goat cheese on top. So we're using a base of arugula, and then we are adding our sliced apples, our sliced onions, and our pecans, or pecans, however you like to say it. And finally, we are finishing off with the little goat cheese balls. So here is the finished salad. Then we are just dressing it with the maple tahini dressing that we made in Sunday's video, and it's time to dig in. This is such a healthy, delicious, seasonal salad that I have been really enjoying, and it's perfect for fall. And there you have it, my friends. That is how to make my apple, pecan, and arugula salad. I hope you enjoyed today's video and recipe. If you wanna see the full instructions and ingredients, I will leave a link to the blog post so you can also see more pictures in the description box below or you can just go to simplykino.com and it should be right on the homepage. And I hope you guys are excited to kick off salad week with me. I think that this is going to be a really fun week full of healthy inspirational meals and hopefully it gives you some ideas for creating inspiring and yummy meals in your own kitchen. So to follow along with Salad Week, you can use the hashtag Salad Week if you make any of the recipes and also make sure to tag at Simply Quinoa so I can find them and give you some love in return. I love seeing all of your guys' creations, it's so much fun. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, make sure to do so by clicking the button that's up in this corner. That will give you a notification whenever I share a new video, which is going to be every single day this week. And other than that, I hope you guys have a really great rest of your day and I will see you tomorrow with another new salad recipe. Talk to you guys later. Bye.